tradition and honor. One Kung Fu master, let's get started, has trained five of the greatest warriors the world has ever known. But this master's biggest challenge has just arrived. I'm coming! <laughs> Stairs. Yeah. <laughs> Jack Black. Go ahead, Panda. Show us what you can do. Um, are they gonna watch or should I just wait until I get back to work or something? Just hit it. Oh, yeah. Get ready to feel the thunder. Come at it with crazy feet. What are you gonna do about crazy feet? I'm a blur. I'm a blur. You never seen bear style. Would you hit it? How's that? <laughs> Everybody was coming. Are you ready? I was born ready. Oh! <laughs> Can I punch through walls? Can I do a quadruple back flip? Focus. Focus. <laughs> that flabby panic is not the warrior. You just need to believe. Oh! That was awesome! Let's go again! This June, when you focus on Kung Fu, you suck. The way to get through to you is with this. Have a dumpling. <laughs> DreamWorks Kung Fu Panda. You have done well, Panda. Done well? <laughs> I've done awesome! Oof. Yes, you have done Awesome. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to our talk show today. I'm Fauzi, your special, special host with this special, special guest. Today, we have a very, very incredible cast from the very, very special movie. The movie called Kung Fu Panda. So, let's welcome the stars of this movie. Okay. First, we have Arsia, who played as Po. We have Raisan, who played as Mr. Pink. And we got Rasha, who played as Master Shifu. And last, we got Tubagus as Tylo, guys. Thanks for having okay. me. Okay, yeah. Welcome, welcome. So, before we dive in, I'd love to hear from each of you who about the characters you play, okay? Arsha, you play as Paul, right? Yes. Who goes through a huge transformation mm. from such a very, very average guy to become a dragon warrior. So what, the, what is the biggest challenge for you of playing this role? Okay, so thanks for it. So the biggest challenge to capturing Paul's emotional journey is that he start as this really interesting kung fu friend, okay. But the problem is that he's got a lot of self doubt on himself, and also showing his growth into a confident hero while also keep his humor intact was tough for me. Oh yeah, that's that's so amazing. That's so amazing. I can imagine how challenging that was. Okay, no reason as Mister P. So, how do you see the relationship between? Mr. Ping and Poe, okay. the what makes the father son bond so so special? Okay, their relationship is very really close. Mr. Ping loves Poe so much, and if even if he doesn't always fully understand Poe ambitions and all there this deep sense of pride. That's what I try to show a mix of love and very from a father perspective. Okay, okay, okay. Beautiful, beautiful. Their father son relationship yes. was very, very, really touching. Really touching. Okay, Russia, yeah. you play as Master Shifu, right? The wise Kung Fu Master. So, what is the most meaningful philosophy that uh, intact and or is stuck with you? Uh, Master Shifu always believe that that the strength comes from within. Uh, not just physical ability. This philosophy is so powerful. 
uh, and that uh, and that's the foundation I use to portray him. It's about uh, I finding inner pitch and trusting your instinct. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, 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 okay. That's such a valuable lesson. So, and to Bagus, as Tailung, you play a very strong antagonist. Uh, what do you think makes Tailung such a complete character? So, and how challenging was you to, to play this that role? All right. Tailung isn't just a villain. He's a someone who feels betrayed and hurt. No. Mm -hmm. The biggest challenge of his uh, deep anger and disappointment, but also his human side. That's what made him so interested to play. Okay, now let's dig a little bit deeper into some scenes in the movie. So first, Arsha, can you tell us what is the most favorite scenes in the movie? Okay, favorite scenes, huh? Okay, I get it. So my favorite has to be where he's accepted that he's the dragon, dragon warrior. warrior. Uh, okay. yes. he, there's some moment of self-acceptance there. It's really great. Yeah. And he's also confident that he's the hero, even though the others are top. Okay, 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 okay. That's definitely an inspiring scene. Yes. Okay. Uh, Raisan, as Mr. Ping, okay. Was there any scene that you found particularly interesting for you? Uh, for me, the challenging scene is there a scene where Mr. Ping finally revealed the secret ingredients of his noodle soup to Paul. It's such an emotional moment because that's when Mr. Ping really saw how proud he is of Paul. That scene really touched me. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That must been a really emotional yes. scene. Okay. Russia. How did you build the chemistry between uh, Master Shifu and Pope in the movie? Uh, I had a lot of discussion with Arsha about their relationship with evil Master Shifu sees Pope potential from the start. But the, he also know that Pope has to find his own way. So I tried to forge a mentor who gentle yet firm, really showing their, their mood. Oh, okay, okay, all right. That's really interesting. And it's definitely crucial for, uh, to the stories of the movie. Yeah. Okay, to Bagus, was there any scenes or dialogue from Tai Lung uh, that was particularly challenging for you? There is one scene uh, Tai Lung finally confronts Master Shibu. The dialogue is full of vengeance and pain but also need for validation. Conveying those complex uh, emotions was real challenge, but I love the challenge. Oh, wow. That's, that's awesome. That's awesome. Okay. Now, now I want to ask you guys about uh, how was your experience working on this movie? Any funny <laughs> moments or any memorable moments uh, you'd like to share with us? Oh, okay. So for me, that... Yeah. Working on Kung Fu Panda was an amazing experience, you know, because once I was trying to mimic where Paul was eating dumplings really fast, okay, like, you know? <laughs> yes, but I ended up with a lot of takes because, you no, know, I couldn't stop loving. It was fun, challenging for Prince Paul's love for me. For me, uh, it was incredible, especially playing such a lovable and quickly character. A memorable moment was during a scene in Un Doodle Soup when someone kept missing up their lines with me. Uh, no other relayed puns and we couldn't stop laughing. Uh, like the scene is very funny for me. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, Russia? For me, uh, the experience was a bit journey. One of my favorite moments was uh, was during a serious scan where someone pawn rang with a silly ringtone, completely breaking the tension we all loved, and then got back to into character. 
Yeah. All right. From me playing Taylor was uh, intense, but the experience can said was awesome and funny. Moment was a uh, during fight scenes. We're here so well, when I accidentally trip over my own fast, we all had a good laugh with a lifted mood during several scenes. Okay, okay. It's been great hearing all this experience from you guys. Yeah. Uh, yes. As we grew up, I'd love to ask all of you, <coughs> what do you think is the main message of the Kung Fu Panda movie that wants to share with the audience, especially kids? Yeah, for me, it's about believing in yourself. Because no matter where you come from or what the other says, what's the most important is that you believe you can. I like that. I like it. For me, another strong message is the importance of family and the support from the people who love us. Without that, poor journey wouldn't have been the same. All right. Okay. Russia. Russia. Uh, from me, we also learn about the importance of inner peace and how it affects your our ability to face external challenge. From me. Uh, from Taylor's perspective, there's a lesson about her ambition without balance can lead to destruction. We need to, to control our desire with a wisdom. Those are some really valuable takeaways from a movie that's so inspiring. Yes. Thank you all so much. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. For your time today, Arsha, Raisa, Raisa, and Tubagus. Thank you for inviting us. Uh, okay. It's been an amazing experience it's with amazing for us. And, and to everyone watching at home, thank you for watching us in here. And see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Yeah.